Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. So it's now been a full week since I ended up unlocking Diamond Camo on the last melee weapon that we needed to unlock Diamond for in Cold War, being the E-Tool or the Shovel. And in that video, I ended up making a deal with you guys that the video ended up hitting 15,000 likes in a week. I would end up doing the whole Dark Ether grind on all the melee weapons in Cold War. And unfortunately, the video didn't end up hitting that like goal. And I think we're sitting at around like 9.5K likes right now. And to be completely honest with you guys, that video did actually underperform in terms of views based on the other Diamond melee weapon videos I did on the channel. And since that video, Video did actually underperform and you guys showed so much love on it i thought we'd go ahead and unlock one dark ether melee weapon today and the weapon we're gonna be unlocking dark ether for is the ballistic knife now a while back when they actually added the ballistic knife into cold war i did actually unlock diamond for it and then i also unlocked dark ether for it but at the time the challenge was bugged out now the one specific challenge that was actually bugged out was the getting 1500 kills with the ballistic knife while it's pack a punched in zombies at the time of me actually unlocking all these challenges and stuff for the ballistic knife it actually showed that this challenge was completely done but it also wouldn't allow me to put on dark ether on the melee weapon because it was saying that i didn't complete all my challenges even though it said it was 35 out of 35 challenges done they eventually updated and fixed it and now it actually shows you what you need to get done in order to unlock dark ether for this weapon and that's what we're going to do for today's video once i do actually unlock dark ether which it shouldn't take too long because all we need is pack a punch kills we'll hop into some multiplayer play a couple games and just see what happens anyways hopefully you guys end up enjoying today's video if you do as always man make sure you drop a like down below let's see if we can hit 6,000 likes anyways without further ado let's go and hop into a zombie game and knock out dark ether on the ballistic knife but I'm sure there's some of you guys that are kind of confused of how I can actually unlock Dark Ether and how I actually do have it unlocked because, I mean, I, I literally only knife. And as you guys know, in multiplayer, I can't have the final camo at all because you have to unlock all the camos for all the guns, and that involves me actually shooting them. So I can't actually do that if I want to remain knife only. So what I decided to do is just hop into zombies, use guns and stuff like that to unlock the camo so I can at least have a final camo and something that actually looks really cool in my melee weapons. But since I am playing a lot more Cold War now like I, I really do want to unlock uh dark ether on all the melee weapons but I also feel like I don't want to upload videos on all the melee weapons you know unlocking it per se what I may do is actually unlock dark ether on a few of them and then if there's one that I'm really feeling and I, I really want to actually check it out in multiplayer and stuff like that I'll actually unlock dark ether for it for a video and uh we'll use it in multiplayer as well like we're gonna do today all right there's one zombie left let's go ahead and get everything done here get the doors unlocked should have enough after buying all these doors uh, at least I'm hoping I have enough I think it's only five thousand for the first pack anyways all right we got pack a punch we got pack a punch one that's a juicy camo which we could actually have this multiplayer i know there's a lot of people that have these like bugged out on their their guns through like hackers and stuff but i'd actually really enjoy that on a ballistic knife oh i forgot about this big shit all right well he's dead he's gonna split then we gotta kill them got that one yeah i'd say at this point probably another round if that and then we'll unlock dark ether on this melee weapon it's not gonna take long oh it's done all right there is gold viper unlocked we got plague diamond and then also dark ether man it's actually been a while since i messed around with the ballistic knife in cold war i'm probably gonna be shaking my first game or so but nonetheless i'm ready to hop into a game and start messing around with it all right the dark ether ballistic knife that actually looks beautiful bo3 dark matter camo is unmatched it really is this is pretty much bo3 dark matter camo it, it's unmatched man no camo can ever rival it this is what it is my personal opinion that's how i feel oh what are they doing what the why was there so many in there no. Oh, that was a terrible decision. That was terrible. Yeah, you fucking... <laughs> we might get some funny reactions this game, though. Something I have noticed with the ballistic knife is that whenever you slide with it, it stops at the end. It's not fluid at all. Got him. Bruh. Oh! Let's go, dude. This ballistic knife is actually mad fun. Might need to take this bad boy into some S and D. No, oh, dude, there's so many in there. I need to utilize my tomahawk too. Oh my, dude, what is happening? We are getting feeds like it's literally nothing this game. I'm not hitting anything crazy, but it's just so many players at all times. Damn. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. 
Oh no. I've died a lot this game, but we've definitely hit some crazy, crazy. Well, I don't want to say clips, but like feeds. Gotcha, buddy. <laughs> oh no dude there was so many why are they all in that room they keep going to that room over and over and over again you can get so many kills going it's crazy oh my god yeah that guy doesn't like me one little bit bro he does it Oh man, that was a fun one. Ah, oh, they came up. Oh, oh, what the? Wait, he just said the hard R. The goddamn clan. Oh my god, this guy is pissed. We're all in trouble. Oh god damn it, that. I didn't mean to do that. I really did not mean to do that, dude. How? I... Dude, what the? Ah, f you, man! What? Oh, it's a clown! God damn it! Nope. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the? How? Oh my god. These guys are not having any fun playing me, that's for sure. We got our asses handed to. Yo, what's up, guys? These nuts, for real? Dude, I watch your videos, like, every day. Really, bro? Appreciate it. Yeah. Are we gonna be on a video? I don't know, maybe, man. Dude, that's awesome. Ooh, we got Echelon. I know it's Echelon. I just like calling it Echelon. People actually get mad in game chat when I do say that, too. There's been a couple times in Search and Destroy, I just literally say, yo, let's vote Echelon, let's play Echelon. Everybody's like, no you this is one of those maps that's just really weird like most people don't like it like i'd say like overflow back in bo2 like a lot of people didn't like that map i really enjoyed it like this map is a map that certain people enjoy but most of the community just skip it every single time it pops up oh stained soul is actually on the enemy team this is probably gonna be a fun one man he's probably gonna be knifing too he might get me a couple times we'll have to see what happens but this is probably gonna be the last game of the video here's dark matter again on the ballistic knife or dark ether whatever you want to call it it's Dark Matter to me, man. BO3 Dark Matter is unmatched. It's uh probably my second favorite camo in the history of COD. Cherry Fizz takes the top there, man. Cherry Fizz was just so good from BO3. Oh. Oh, I got him. Got him. Fuck. Oh, what the hell? Ah, bitch. Got him. Damn. Ooh. Got him again. Ah, uh, see. Ah. Uh. Got him. Still one in here too. I don't know where he's gonna go. I think he's up top. Oh no! Shit. Oh, there we go. And the more I use this thing, the better I'm gonna get with it. Right now, I'm kind of like average, but I feel like the more I use it, I'm gonna actually get pretty decent with it. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I really did not mean to do that. That was also a major issue I was having with using melee weapons at the beginning of Cold War. Yeah. Like, <laughs> but like I was always like meleeing them and I would accidentally hold it down a little too long and it would execute them and it messed me up all the time on streaks and stuff. So I just started, ended up using my right trigger to, to melee people. Cause it just wasn't worth it. Oh, and this little shit. Yeah, I've died a lot so far this game. Echelon's one of those maps that, like, sometimes you can do well on, and then most of the time it's just not going to work out knifing-wise. Damn! <laughs> I bet you this little shit still up here with a strip mine. Doesn't have a strip mine no more. Got both Hi. of them. <laughs> Dude, stop. Why is this guy doing this, bro? <laughs> he literally puts his strip mine at the bottom and... <laughs> It's so corny because people are going to pass it every single time. I mean, I guess it is elite strats, right? He's got me multiple times with it. Nope. 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 Oh. Ah. 
Wow! Whoa, what the hell is going on? Get that out of here, bro. No, no. Oh my God. No. <laughs> what the hell is going on, dude? This is chaotic as hell. Oh, got him again. Oh. Nope. Oh, that was unfortunate. Oh, got him. Right in the noggin. <laughs> no. <laughs> Yo, this is great. Oh, man. I wish I could play against them another game, man. I hate how lobbies disband in this game. It sucks, dude. It really does. Wait, he's going to actually shoot me? What happened to your melee, bro? What are you doing? Oh, no. I thought he was only mailing. Well, oh, okay. Yo, GG's, bro. That was a fun one. Bro, that was insane. I was about to lose my kid. Bro, that was insane. <laughs> just so Yo, you know, GGs, I'm gonna though, you, guys. Yeah, just so you know, this is going to go on my video today. So be on the lookout for that, bro. Dude, hell yeah. <laughs> you picked my gun up and Appreciate killed me. Appreciate the love, bro. <laughs> hell yeah. I'll send hella likes your way. Hey, that's what's up, man. All right, well, that's gonna do it for the video. Hopefully, you guys ended up enjoying it. Shout out to Stain Soul. He was definitely a dope dude. And I uh, appreciate the love, man. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.